Hello and good whatever time of the day it is you ladies and just woods. My name is Vidit and I've come all the way from Southern Mars and whoo I was a long trip coming here. You have no idea how many times my spaceship got towed and the amount of parking tickets I have. It's over six digits. <sighs> if only I had a teleporter. Teleportation! That's it! What a wonderful idea for a TED talk! Eh? 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 So jumping right into things, what is teleportation? And why do we need it to say a rainbow rhinoceros in a bathtub? Well, look, I'm here and now I'm here. That's teleportation. In a more long-winded explanation of things, Teleportation is the act of matter or energy instantly moving from one place to another by disappearing and then reappearing in a new place. For such definition, teleportation would be very fast, being instant. This already gives it advantages over modern transport, including the rainbow rhinoceros in the bottom. But that's not all. Uh, Furthermore, teleportation would be financially efficient and uh, would emit less pollution if you consider the long-term effects and costs of cars and other forms of modern transport. But is it possible? I hear you ask. Well, yes, teleportation is possible. It would work through a process called quantum entanglement. Quantum entanglement is a process similar to 3D printing, except in this you would have to gather the information about an object and then transport that information through radio signals before printing out that information onto atoms. In fact, uh, the photons and electrons have already been teleported on Earth. While there's a long way off from teleporting beings like me and you, which the baby stuff should count in the long run. But now for the big question, why am I telling you this? Well, you see, as Martians had previously decided that Earth didn't require teleportation, but now, after a careful re-evaluation, we decided that you Earthlings require teleportation just as much as us, after considering just your traffic problems. Therefore, we've started the teleportation funding and exchange program, which enables you to fund our research and send your best scientists to help us. We hope you consider this to solve both our problems and thank you.